break for it. Your ass is going down. Nobody's paying you to open your mouth, Vasquez. Experience. Got a tough customer with that Vasquez. Even for a badge. He is set in his ways. Like so many men. This brain dance. I'm curious. Tell me more. Title's the passion. We're speaking to the LCD, of course. And it's gonna revolutionize BD. How so? Well, Stevenson's furlough is only so long, we can only scroll the last bit with him. But we'll fill in the run-up to the finale with BD doubles and Nemo Bank assets. It'll feel like Stevenson, though. How's that even possible? Give me a break. We're part of EBM. Infinite investment in tech. A couple of years and we won't be using actors anymore. My dream of the day. So why Josh? Sounds like you don't even need him now. The son of man's agony. You can't weave it strictly out of digital threads just yet. And you, get any say on all this? He forced the writers to go with the Christian gospel according to Luke. It originally opted for John. Guess that's, uh, important for... John's version is crude and over the top. The gospel of Luke speaks more to my sensibility. Besides, Luke's Christ is prepared for what awaits him. I want the world to understand that. Feel it. What is it you want to convey, exactly? That Christ was merciful, and continues to die for the world's sins. Chatter's pointless. That's enough. Stevenson can't be distracted. He has to focus now. Relax, Rachel. Yes, why, I don't know anything about you. How do you spend your leisure time? What do you do to unwind? None of your fucking business. I mean it as a serious question. I meditate. Didn't take you for one with the spiritual side. You being... well... you. Know what your problem is, all of you? You refuse to understand that spirituality can only ever be personal. And why the fuck are you here anyway? For the free meal? I'll tell you exactly why. No, I, I don't give the slimmest shit what you have to say. Ugh, all this talk about grace and salvation and transformation. I could puke. Take it from a beady producer. Religion's an elaborate lie. All of them. But, Rachel... No, we're done for the day. Finish your meal, we'll put you up at the studio. And you... get lost. We'll get your fee soon. Goodbye, V. I am truly glad to have met you. Props. Really well played, Dad. What do you make of it all? Guy just might be the biggest nut job I've ever seen, but it's still corporate exploitation. Don't make trouble. Be trouble. There's smoke. Let's get out of here. It doesn't matter. As long as he's a better man than he used to be. We could talk in circles, but who cares what we think? What would it change? Corpse will continue to grow rich off his type, and the masses will live on with their pipe dreams. Hang on, where's Rebel Johnny? Seemed to have lost him. Well, I found him. He's inside that guy. He's the real Rebel. Make up your mind, which is it? 
nut job or messiah. He's fucked in the head. The world's fucked in the head. And you're fucked in the head because my fucked up head is inside it. Guess if you want to save the world, that's the first step. Get fucked in the head. What do you think? God exists? Fuck, kill me, please. Come on, serious question. What? Why? So you flatlined, then got your beat back. Don't tell me that's left you wondering if a construct can easily save. The truth is, I died and rose again. Plain and simple. Uh-huh, so what was that? A miracle? What's it make you? A messiah, a phoenix, or a factory restored early model archer? Got no fucking idea what it was. And neither do you. Tell you exactly what brought you back. A clever bit of corpo tech. If there's a true messiah among us, I'll tell you who it is. Saburo Arasaka. One you'd summarily execute if you ran into him. See, that's why I'm me and you're you. You drop to your knees before gods. I drop them, pop them right between the eyes. You're gonna tell me you don't think about being a digital psyche. Possible consequences thereof. Really? I mean, are you already dead or alive till the last existing digi ghost of you is shredded? Meaning, like, am I gonna ascend to digi heaven? Descent to Digi Hell's more likely. But yeah, there is life after death. Does Silverhand already live in the afterlife? And I'm talking to his animated epitaph? I don't give it an ounce of thought. Surprise. To me, I'm just that. Me. No netherworld, no happy wonder world. Just duped digital psyches. Weird as fuck today. Just kind of unreal. But reality beckons. Come on, we got places to trash. Claire. V, ready for the next race? Already here, ready and waiting. Want to use your own ride or am I bringing Beast? We'll take my ride. Feels more natural to me. You get it. Of course. Yours it is. Meet there. Yeah. Rancho. Be right there. See you then. Hey, v. I'm gonna take a look under the hood before we start, see if all's okay. But stay close, just in case. Not worry this will get you killed. What, today? The race? Why? I'm not asking about just today. It could be, though. Or the next one. One after that. Chew and mine got shocked and killed by a faulty toaster in her own kitchen. So, you know, it is what it is. Case or all's wrong. Our chances, how do you see him? Well, it's gonna be tough to beat out Luigi. And he's got Margot riding Gunner today. Right, so... Girl loves popping flats, but don't get hung up on it. Let it mess with your head. Just focus on the route, let me handle the entertainment. Sorry, you need a minute to kick the tires before we get moving. Sure. Come on! I want to smell that juju bird! 
dare him to try! You should know. Okay. Sit down for a spell over there. Yeah, me and Dean. We like to come here. Wanted to tell me something? I mentioned Dean before. My husband, yeah. Wheel to your heat, right? Sweetest man I ever knew. We were friends before my gender transition. We brought daffodils to the hospital. It's a new beginnings, he said. Were you married long? Twelve years. Dean used to laugh that for our 15th, said he'd finally talked me into my first implant. I was prepping some surprise. Why tell me about Dean? Meaning, why now? He died during a race last year. The final. Not your standard fatality, though. Are you saying you feel at fault for his death? Me at fault? Why would you think that? He was flatlined by a corpo eagle weasel. Peter Sampson. Exceptional walking rot. What's the corpo's deal? Doesn't really matter. It was only ever another adversary to me. But to Dean. Dean and Sampson had a history going way back. And something happened between them? Dean never admitted anything, but yeah. Yeah, there was some kind of strife. Something personal to their rally rivalry. When Samson came first, Dean got hot and bothered. Your husband, how'd he die exactly? We'd just powered into the final straight, Samson peeling up the tarmac ahead of us. It was clear we couldn't win, so Dean let up on the chew. And then that snake slammed on the brakes. Dean also had to. We lost control. Hey, but isn't that how this race works? You don't get it. Road was clear to the finish line. He would have won. It was premeditated. Right. So this isn't business as usual. 
For you, this isn't about winning. That's right. Fuck winning. I want Samson dead. And this is your best plan for vengeance. Folks die on the track all the time. Won't seem unusual at all. Another day at the races, in line with the rules. And if Samson doesn't show for the race, what then? <laughs> He'd never miss a chance to puff out his chest. He'll race. Circuit champ last year. No way he'll let that go, not try to repeat. And me? Guess you want my help to zero him. Killing Samson matters more than taking first. We have to make a choice. Sorry I lied to you, V. So, what do you say? If Samson dies by the rules of the game, all right. But I won't help you execute the guy. Can't count on that. That's fair. I can agree to that. It's all I can promise. Trust me. Revenge don't soothe your soul. It just makes you a killer. That's all. Not the way I see it. But fine. Till the final, V. dreams. I'd gladly kick the balls off the idiot who thought that one up. No complications with Kang Tao. So far, so good. They sent another patrol around the station, but they're dead set that it was Raffin that downed their AV and attacked Hellman's guards. Station's proprietors sticking to that version, so we're covered for now. How's it going with Rogue? It's going. Knock on wood. So, things are settled? For now, we're good at avoiding each other, and that's fine with me.
Well, do you have any thoughts? Well? Come here. Ah, oh, stop. How's it going? Depends on what the it is. And what you want to hear. Oh, you know, the huge. I longed for you, V. Oh, I see you've already played out this conversation all on your own. Force of habit. Pan Am. <laughs> I did, though. I missed you. I could sit here with you all night. I think I'd like that. Let's talk a little while longer, before I have to Delta somewhere. You have no idea how much I needed that. What's up, V? 
Yeah, it's been a long day. <laughs> <laughs>